At six, we're asking about the local impact after the Boy Scouts of America filed for bankruptcy. The group is facing hundreds of lawsuits alleging past sex abuse by scout leaders. The bankruptcy announcement comes on the heels of an 80% increase in membership fees to help pay for liability insurance. As WCNC Charlotte's Tanya Mendes reports, at least 15 former leaders from the Carolinas are among the accused. New at six, she joins us with reaction from the Mecklenburg County Scout Council. Well, despite the bad news coming out on the national level with the Boy Scouts, the Mecklenburg County Council says that's got nothing to do with them. They're a separate entity from the national level, and it's going to be business as usual here. An organization built on its morality, now accused of being morally bankrupt and financial. Boy Scouts of America filing for bankruptcy on the heels of one of the biggest sexual abuse scandals since the Catholic churches. Hundreds of boys say they were abused at the hands of hundreds of scout leaders. And now a new law will allow more victims to come forward and get their day in court. BSA saying they're filing for bankruptcy to continue services to troops and to pay out the abuse victims. Just because they declare bankruptcy does not prevent survivors from having justice. It'll just be through a different process. The Mecklenburg County Boy Scout Council, though, saying they are totally separate from the national organization. They issued a statement to NBC Charlotte Tuesday saying meetings and activities, district and council events, other scouting adventures and countless service projects are taking place as usual. In short, there should be no change to the local scouting experience. But scouts dues increased 80% this year and that added insult to injury for many. You cannot trust the Boy Scouts of America to weed out the bad apples because they haven't. When the sexual abuse accusations broke, it impacted the Carolinas as well. 11 former leaders from North Carolina, four from South Carolina, accused of abusing boys as young as seven, often on camping trips. Two local cases, one from Gastonia and one from Charlotte. Both men eventually convicted of sex crimes against children. We reached out to the Mecklenburg County Council to find out if anyone else from our area has come forward now that the new law is in effect. They say there are no new accusations. The Boy Scout certainly has a long history founded back in 1910. They currently boast more than 2 million members. I'm Tanya Mendes, WCNC Charlotte.